Ah. Stand by for your CBBC mates to take you on the UK's strangest road trip. Add an Ian Gopero car racing. There be Chris looking for buried treasure. Arr! Ranny dodges fireballs. Barney's dressed as a pigeon. And Naomi and rather scarily Ed are dressed to impress. All over the place. All over the place. North, south, east, west. On a bizarre quest. Me and my mates all over the place. It's true what you've heard. Everything is absurd. Whatever we do is straight for true. Nice wheels, Ed. Yeah, well, I thought I'd ditch the Mini and go for something more sporty, you know, more racy. Yeah, this is fast, mate. It's speedy. It's action-packed. Yeah, you're not wrong. Just need somewhere to race it now. <laughs> well, we are in Hampshire. There's a race on today. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, let's go. Yeah, let's go. I'll, where do I... Where do I sit in it, though? Because I'll need to... Ed, I'll probably... Ed? Welcome to the Pedal Car Grand Prix, chaps. The pedal cars race round the high street, but don't worry, it's closed off to traffic for the day. The winner is the team who has completed the most one kilometre laps over two hours. Ed and Ian, time to meet your teams. I am Team Phoenix, am I right? Yes. Good. And I'm on the round table team. Yes, right? you are, yeah. And Good, these, okay. these are our humble steeds, I believe. They are mighty chariots. Born to be wild. I mean, do I have to, I don't have to cycle this whole thing on my own, do I? No, no, it's okay. You've got another three team members. Good, good. Oh, look at Go, 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 The teams have very different tactics. Ed's team will race for two laps at the most before changing drivers. While Ian's team will only change after 15 minutes at the wheel. You'll be racing against over 50 other teams, so you'll need to pedal for your winner's medal. Right, I think we should check out the competition. Good idea, Petrie. Good. I mean, look at this one. This is, and this is real competition. It looks wow. like it looks sort of a bit gothic. That's very aerodynamic, isn't it? Yeah. I'm just checking for hidden engines. Cheeks never prosper. Yeah. I mean, what's this for? So he can reach the pedals. <laughs> small to reach the pedals. Also, yeah. probably padding for the bum. Yeah. Do you think yeah. I'm going to get? Do you think I'm going to get a sore bum on this thing? Yeah. I'm going to be walking like this. Yeah. Yeah. Oh dear. So actually, do you know what? I might keep this actually, guys. So, see you later. Oh. Bye. <laughs> see ya. I'm, start, I'm starting to get a bit worried because I found out that my team did very badly last year. I'm like Lewis Hamilton. If Lewis Hamilton drove what is essentially a tin bath on wheels. Just look, Ed, Ed's the only one not in the car. Everyone else is sat being the rules and he's in the pit stop acting like an idiot. He's been immature. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to roll about on the floor in a public place, wear longer shorts next time. I'm so nervous. And they're off! The team that completes the most laps in two hours is the winner, but each four-person team has different tactics. So will it be Ed or Ian that gets pedal carried away? Ed gets off to a good start. But Ian's matching him. It's neck and neck in the early stages. Some of these are going really fast! Whoa! This is exhausting! And it's Ed first into the pit. Whoa! Oh, sorry, wrong way around, sorry. Oh, oh it's exhausting. Oh. Uh, luckily, we're doing a maximum of two laps. I think Ian's going 15 minutes. He's going to be really tight. There he goes. <laughs> and while Ed takes a break, Ian keeps on going. Water. Oh, yeah. Oh, my legs feel like they're on fire. This is horrible. Ian. 
Ben's feeling tired, so they're bringing him in early. Oh, my legs. How are the legs? Oh. Oh. How are the quads there, eh? I can't walk. I can't walk. <laughs> oh, and we have some early race updates just coming through. Just been reliably informed that after the first few laps, and partly my terrible 15 minutes, uh, our team is ahead of your team. How many laps have you done? I don't know, but we're ahead. Aye, less of the bickering. And more of the racing, you two. This race won't win itself, you know. Oh no, things come to a grinding halt for Team Petrie. Eat my dust indeed. Could this cost him the race? Oh. Thank you! Oh no, that was no good, my train just came off. That was bad. You reckon? Uh, time to change drivers before you break anything else, Ed. Don't know how we're doing. The latest news is that you're one lap behind Ed. So if you're going to catch Ian, you better get back out there. Take this on two pretty quick laps here. I'll just do a handprint with all this bike grease. There you go. One corner seems to be causing a few crashes. Let's hope Ed and Ian are more careful. Oh, this is my favourite! Oh, no. oh, you nearly made a big impact on the race there. Peachy's going to pep talk because he's one lap down and it's looking like he might lose. <laughs> Right, last lap, last lap! Yeah, final lap! Ah. Things are getting really serious. I'm so tired. I think I prefer my normal car! Oh. That checkered flag means the end of the race, but who's the winner? So while the judges are working out how many laps each team has completed, everyone takes a lap of honour. <laughs> but will it be Speedy Sterling or Pacey Petrie who picks up the all-over-the-place pedal car trophy? So, Conrad, the race director, is going to tell us who's won. Ed, you've done 45 laps. Very quite respectable. Good. That's quite good, and isn't Ian, it? And Ian, yeah. you did. <laughs> Afraid you did 47 laps. I'll have that. So you, you can have that. Thanks very much. Look at his smug face. Look at that. You've been watching all over the place.